little walkthrough video of uh, my fall decor around the house and depending on how long that video is uh, I thought that I might just add this little thrift store haul on to it as well. I uh, had to go into the city with my husband. He had left the transport in at the dealership for them to uh, put a specific part on the back for him for his fifth wheel and uh, it was ready and he needed me to go in with him so I could drive the pickup back home and I didn't have a problem with that because I told him that I was going to go thrifting uh, there was something in particular I was looking for that for to finish a craft so he said okay so I did go into um, Value Village and then I remembered that I have the keys for the house, so I knew I had to be fast. But anyways, went into Value Village and I did find what I was looking for. But as I was walking around, I saw a couple of other items and you know how it is. You see something and you pick it up. So the first thing that I saw was this very adorable, cute little scarecrow. And he has a pumpkin head on him. And I think he's just so cute. He is ceramic. He's got the straw, you know, coming out of the pants, out of the sleeves. He's got his straw hair and he is ceramic. Oh, I just noticed a little chip on the back of his hat, but that's okay. I'm not sure how I'm going to display him. He's going to have to lean up on something, but I just think he's so adorable. His little pumpkin head too. I can leave him out right through to my uh, Halloween decor. So he was $2.99. But I did have a 30% off coupon. So let me see. I'm not sure what. It wasn't on everything that you purchased. It was only on a couple of things. Let me see. Okay, so he was Halloween and I did get 30% off. So 90 cents off. So I only paid 209 for him. He is well worth 209 And he's got the little, uh, his little scarf is fabric. It's so cute. And the other thing that I picked up was um, a Tim Hortons mug. We do have a collection. I don't actually have them displayed right now because uh, if you remember me saying some of our stuff got damaged in the move and uh, they smashed my glass shelves for my china cabinets. So we're still dealing with the moving company and the insurance company and uh, we'll see what happens there. But I have... Two china cabinets sitting in the house with nothing in them because there's no shelves. But anyways, I don't have this mug. This one says Canada celebrating 150 years Tim Hortons. And it's got, it's so cute. It's got hockey skates and uh, A, the beaver, donuts, Timbits, a loon. It's got, um, I guess that's for, um, what do you call that? Maple syrup. <laughs> hockey sticks on the back it's got the uh the canada geese as well and i like what's inside it it's red inside with a maple leaf in the middle so they will always tell you what year they came out so this was 2017 that this one came out and they always say limited edition on them you always see them at the thrift stores well anyway it was priced 5.99 and I did get the 30% off on that as well. So I got $1.80 off. So I only paid $4.19 for it. So I was okay with that. Yep. And then uh, I, I always walk through the whole store because you never know what you're going to see. And I've seen this um, little doily. Obviously someone's handmade it. That's a lot of work gone into this. And it is Christmas colors. Red, white, and green. I use these colors every year for my uh, Christmas decor. So I thought that this would be quite nice with one of my miniature trees sitting on it. So I got this for $2.99. And it's a good size. It's, it's pretty big. So I did get that for Christmas time. We will put that away. Yeah, there was no no uh, discount on that. So it was $2.99. And the thing that I was looking for, I was able to find. I wanted a uh, cable knit sweater. And I wanted it in that, uh, you know, creamy color or white. And I was able to find one. And I didn't care if it was children's, men's, ladies, because I'm crafting with it. But I found this one in the ladies department. And it's actually a nice sweater. It's too bad it wouldn't be my size. But anyways... 
Uh, I picked this one up for my craft and I did pay $6.49 for it. But just a little sneak peek of what I'm doing with it is um, you need to, if you want to do this with me, you want to pick up two of these um, wreath forms, the uh, pumpkin ones from Dollar Tree. I had these from last year because I was supposed to make this last year and I didn't. So you need these and you need some twine and uh, whatever fabric you want to use. So this is the fabric I'm using and we're going to make a wreath. So that was it that I bought at Value Village. Now, when I'm going to Value Village in Winnipeg, I have to pass the Salvation Army. They're both on like the left side if I'm going west. So I was uh, heading west and I go turn at the lights into Value Village. And then on the way back, I'd pass uh, the Salvation Army store. And I always find good things in that little store. I think this is where this top came from. So I uh, I ran in there, you know, knowing that my husband's waiting for me. But I went in quick and uh, I walked around, didn't see any crafting items or anything. And they do keep some of their nicer pieces uh, in behind glass doors in a cabinet, right? So I went over and there was these two ladies over there. And uh, they were Ukraine. They were speaking Ukraine. And uh, they were going on. And all I could hear from them was coach, coach. And I'm like, oh, coach. So I went over there. To, and they didn't realize what they had their eye on. But I had seen this really cute little uh, coach, uh, crossbody little purse. So I'm watching them. And one of them went to get the lady that works there. And she come over to open the cabinet. And uh, they were looking at the coach shoes that were on the middle. So she took them out, tried them on, and she asked if she could go look in the mirror. So as she went to look at herself in the mirror, I said, can I see the little crossbody purse on the bottom? And they went, oh, coach, but I spotted it first and the lady got it and she handed it out to me. And was I ever happy that this isn't what those ladies had their eyes on because it's genuine, it's brand new. I got a coach crossbody little purse. And I know you can smell the leather, but how you know that it's uh, genuine is they number all their stuff. So, and I mean, this is the lining. It is, it's brand new. No one's ever used this. But anyway, you, uh, you can flip it out there. And if you look at the label, it's got all their details on it, but then they number everything. They number all their products. So I was super happy to get this and it's in purple. And my daughter bought me a little clutch wallet in purple. And so I can use that if I want in here, you know, I can put my wallet inside this front pocket. I can put my phone in and, uh, you know, I'm hands free then because I do take my cane with me when I do go shopping. And sometimes I use my walker. So this is going to be excellent. I was so pleased to find it. She also, my daughter also bought me a full size uh, coach purse in pink and I love it. But I just fell in love with this. It's perfect. It's small. It's good. If I'm going, you know, into the doctors or next week when I go and have my cast removed, I'll just have this on me, right? Now, I paid $29.99. And was I ever super happy? I mean, that's an excellent price because this purse is, I would say, a minimum $200. So I also, I saw on the sign too, on the door, on the way in, it said no tax. And I'm like, oh, no tax. So that's exactly what I paid, $29.99. And then she says it's a final sale. And I'm like, I'm okay with that. So $29.99 was my total. And the, yeah, she just wrote final sale on the inside. So you never know what you're going to find at a thrift store. And my husband maybe waited about 10 minutes for me. And that was it. Because I was able to catch up to him. <laughs> so anyways, that is it for my haul. And uh, I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope that you all venture out to your local thrift stores and find some treasures too. Uh, take care. Have a great day. And I'll see you all on my next video. Bye for now.